Hey, this is Mirgloff, and this is Mirgloff Builds, and right away, uh, this uh, Third Street house is owned by New Ted Trents. Uh, I assume it's Ted, like sort of like uh, the, but uh, the mill spelt way. I'm not exactly sure what Ted is, but there we have it. And this is an update episode, uh, number three. And uh, in this video, I'm going to be uh, discussing uh, what I've already, what I've done in the last ten episodes, uh, and what I plan to do in the last ten episodes, or the next ten episodes. That is um, something I've gone around and done is uh, put book bookcases in some of the houses. Uh, but the stuff that I have done, on, I also put these here. Uh, what I, what I've built in the last ten episodes are uh, the houses over here, three houses. Uh, this one, Third Street Two A, Third Street Three A, Silver Street One A. Let's take a quick look in some of these houses. And here's this one. It's got some bookcases. And let's quickly take a look at these other two. And I've also built uh, one store and and a uh, the library. And uh, the library's sort of like a the enchanting place for wizards and stuff. And uh, this is sort of like a study area of bookshelves. And this is a two-bedroom house. This one is. I've also gone around and put a. Uh, what I've just finished doing is just gone around and putting two bread in every chest next to a bed. You know, everyone's personal chest. Uh. And then I don't think I built that in the last ten episodes. So let's take a look at the uh, the bakery and the library. This is the library, and I've already done one enchanting. I got a not this chest plate, but I got another chest plate that uh, has some fire resistance level two or three. I can't remember. And this is the bakery. It's very simple did not take very much to build but I think it is elegant nonetheless and uh, I've also made some animal breeding pens mostly for sheep I haven't really done anything with the chickens although my plan was to uh, har uh, breed chickens so I can kill them for their feathers but what I plan to do in the next uh, 10 episodes uh, I'm not sure whether or not uh what the if it'll go as planned, but my intention is to finish building the town of Mirgloff. Uh, I only have a couple more things to build. Uh two more commercial buildings. Uh I haven't made up my mind on what those will be. I just had an idea for one of them and I've forgotten what it was. Then I plan on building sort of like a uh tr uh not a treasury, you know, but a, a trading place by the docks. I believe I said at one point that I'd be making it a uh, warehouse, but I've changed my mind about that. I've also uh, changed up the uh, town square by putting market stalls instead of having like a grandstand or whatever it was I had over there. It looks a lot better. And, uh, oh yeah, and uh, so one of the final things I'll be doing for uh, building this town is building a wall. I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to do it yet. It's not going to be like this. I just put this uh, cobblestone here to make it so that uh, no mobs can jump in because I was thinking about the uh, design of the town and how to build a wall. In some places I don't want to build a wall. Like right over there I don't want a wall. And the type of wall that I'm going to build is going to be a wooden one. So this is gonna be a sort of look like a passelade wall with uh, like wooden posts like this, and then some fence pieces 
between that and then the next wooden post, or maybe two fence pieces wide. Oh, I did not put bread in here. And I built these farms. I also built this uh, farmhouse soft camera. Oh, oh there's snow on uh, my watermelons. So a watermelon and pumpkin farm. A reed farm over there, which I've been uh, harvesting reeds for bookcases, although it's uh, really slow. I guess apparently they uh, nerfed the sp growing speed of uh, reeds, is what Goodman's Ghost tells me. And I'll put bread in these, the other one later. But, um. Uh, Oh, okay, I remember what I was going to make a shop for. I was going to make a general store. Because so far I have uh, a couple of shops, but none of them are general store stuff. One of them's a tool, tool, toolsmith. And a, uh, what was the other one? A, oh, a craftsman. Like, just, like, for beds, ben uh, chairs, and that kind of stuff. Then I have the bakery. So I'm going to make a general store, and then I need something else. I'm not exactly sure what it is that this town needs. A carpenter, maybe? I don't know. That's not really a store. But, um... Anyways, I can't think of anything else to the discuss regarding, uh... The, the last ten episodes and what I'm planning to do next. Uh, once I finish building this town... I'm going to move on to building a new town, and I'm not sure if I have want to build how I want to do find a new location, whether or not I want to just wander and find a good landscape to build a new town, or if I should do what I said I did, said I was going to do before, and uh, just go real far in the nether, well not real far, but travel some distance in the nether and make another portal out and build wherever I end up so either I can pick a random place via the nether or just pick a good terrain and I'm right now leaning towards just picking out a spot that I want to build at because I may end up with at some place I don't like I almost forgot um, I'm gonna be switching the recording style back to the time lapse since I uh, the feedback that I got was that the uh, time lapse was cooler and the feedback being uh, just one person I only got one person feedback but that's that's okay uh, I assume either way people enjoyed and uh, I'm gonna begin also uh, making some uh, special buildings for uh, people who've already subscribed to say thank you and thank you for subscribing and uh, if you enjoyed this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up and thank you for watching